everyone in this uh, problem we have given a statement that n factorial is equal to n cube minus n and we have solved this for n we can write n factorial as n into n minus 1 and on the right side we can take n as common and here we get n square minus 1. So we can divide both sides by n but first we have to check whether n is a non-zero number or not because here involves the factorials so n must be a positive integer and uh, here we have to confirm whether n is non-zero or not. We can easily check from the given equation if we substitute 0. Uh, here 0 factorial is 1 and on the right 0 minus 0 will be 0. So 1 cannot be equal to 0 thus n is not equal to 0. It means we can divide this uh, n uh, on both sides and uh, after division this uh, n will be cancel out with these n and we will get uh, n minus 1 factorial this must be equal to n square minus 1 now we can write it as n minus 1 factorial is equal to n square minus 1 we can use the famous identity a square minus b square that is a plus b into a minus b and we can write it as n minus 1 into n plus 1 and we can write left side that is n minus 1 factorial equal to n minus 1 into n minus 2 factorial that is equal to n minus 1 into n plus 1. Now here again we can divide both sides by n minus 1 but first we have to check whether n minus 1 is equal to 0 or not 0. So from here n minus 1 is equal to 0 if n is equal to 1 so we substitute again in this equation if we substitute 1 factorial is equal to 1 and 1 minus 1 is equal to 0 so n cannot be 1 it means n minus 1 is not equal to 0 and we can divide this on both sides by n minus 1 and this n minus 1 will cancel out with this n minus 1 and thus uh, we will get uh, n minus 2 factorial that is equal to n plus 1 and uh, from here let we substitute let we substitute let uh, n minus 2 is equal to r then this implies that n is equal to r plus 2 we substitute this over here we will get n r factorial is equal to n is equal to r plus 2 plus 1 and from here r factorial is equal to r plus 3 so if we check by substituting by inspection if we substitute 0 or 0 factorial is 1 and right side will become 3 it is not equal if we substitute r is equal to 1 then this again does not satisfy if r is equal to 2 then 2 is equal to 5 is not satisfied if we substitute 3 we will get 6 is equal to 6 
it means on inspection we have three factorial is equal to six which is equal to three plus three it means r is equal to three satisfies the given equation and since we have substitute uh, n minus 2 is equal to r it means from our substitution n minus 2 that is equal to 3 and from here we can easily see that n is equal to 5 and uh, that is the required answer we can check this whether this is satisfying the given equation or not 5 factorial is 120 5 cube is 125 and 5 minus 5 so 120 is equal to 120 thus the solution of a given equation is 5 and that is the answer if you are new on my channel then please subscribe my channel and give a thumbs up to the video Thank you for watching.